Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back. So, welcome to the patch note update. Um, can't talk really loud right now because it's actually pretty late at night. But what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going through everything in the patch. Okay, so um, you know this is actually just just released from the on Confey neighbor, and it's only it's only been like 10 minutes since it's out. Um, I was a little bit late, didn't get to it right away. So it turns out there's going to be a new new nat 5 monster um you know before actually reading the name i saw the picture i was like this is artemis like you know 100 percent um and it, it turns out it actually was you know I, I'm, I'm not lying okay I, I like it was my first guess um so there's artemis and proc whatever the fuck proc is and there's gonna be a light dark so i'm guessing that proc something proc is probably something that already exists but i don't know what the translation is this is basically just cafe neighbor automatically translated um so there's gonna be a new nat 5 monster and there's gonna be a light dark version uh all right let me just let me just take a look uh extreme star star sanctuary 10 when stage is clear angels colossus dungeon will be open with a total of 10 floors it consists of mainstream adventures all right you go in um ancient ancient dungeon classes details battle four people second tier combat four people total eight the star you have driven to or basically it's like uh you know two parties of four um you can participate in the battle during the battle two you can participate you, you can replace two parties so you basically you know basically it's like a relay system or not a relay um a tag in system you can switch them back and forth you can only participate on in the same star mon monster at the party regardless of attribute evolution stage so on okay so this is basically saying that you can't use the same monster um, we pretty much already knows it know this and then there's going to be um, you can part there because of limited opportunities part party so there's going to be a cooldown um, I think before they mentioned it was going to be two turns so 20 considered combat support time will be after the first clear so basically you can do auto times 20 after the first clear the ally destroyer function is not supported uh, i think this is like a, you can't have a monster like you can't use someone else's rep to do this and then there's gonna be a new gem so wait are they adding are they are they putting siphon here i think they're putting colossus they're putting siphon and leech Cause this this looks like SP plus twenty percent. This looks like a hybrid of a uh, valor and uh, protection. So basically, it's like attack and then it minuses defense. And I'm guessing this is plus defense minus attack. This is probably plus recovery minus attack. This is probably plus HP minus resistance. Hmm, interesting. The dragon dungeon will separate dungeon list. Uh, marked as separate island, ancient golem dungeons are separate dungeons, including. Uh, are they closing Dragon Dungeon? It says it's going to be separated. I don't know if they're going to close it this weekend. I probably should stop stop farming sigils. How many? Yeah, right now, right now I'm just. Uh, I just have my party up. Maybe I should instead of farming sigils. Um, start farming golems it will, it will kind of be sad i have like 60 sigils really don't want to waste them but you know if i really do waste them it's just you know it's just it's kind of just too bad but it shouldn't matter too much so um i think it might be safe it might not be safe to keep farming dragons it, it says the dragon dungeon is going to be separated but it doesn't say the dragon dungeon is going to be closed so i'm not too sure i'm probably going to start stop farming story map and start farming um golem to try to save up some gold and uh we'll see which monsters are good for for colossus and now i guess i'll six star those monsters um gym inventory is going to be upgraded to 250 slots so 50 more slots that's that's definitely really really good um adding challenges ancient colossus first clear and then clearing and then termination of gemini capture event so after the event uh ends the gemini's will stop spawning Ancient Colossus Update Material Festival price package um, applies to next Heroes Festival. I think they're lowering the price of Heroes Fest, maybe. That, that, that actually might be pretty good news. Um, just to start balance, 
light will be changed to t physical type, so tank type. Um, bar barred light dark will be ch changed, so light now has absorb and during critical attack, and now she no longer needs to crit to absorb. Ooh. Uh, silence 80% chance for one turn is going to be changed to two turns, so this, this is actually pretty good improvement. Um, slowing decreases critical, uh, I think this is blind, and then taunt will also um, provoke as well. If you have more than two, improve automatically unlock a lock star monster chosen for evolution, composite material. Oh, that's actually just a quality of life update. All right, so uh, now I now I just want to I kind of just want to talk um, about some predictions. I mean, it's one day before the patch actually comes out, but I think it might be safe to start stop farming dragons just for today. Um, if you're still farming for sigils, but I'm probably the only one in the game that's like hardcore farming for sigils. Maybe there's other people as well. If they're changing siphon to be dropped, actually, I'm not sure if this this is siphon. It doesn't look like a siphon. Oh wait, it's not siphon. No, it's not siphon. Um, this is uh, they talked about this new gem gem set. Basically, whenever you enter a stage, you start the stage off with 10% extra SP instead of uh, instead of having siphon. I think siphon's still superior, but you know this, this is not too bad. Um. The other really cool thing is like I, I really like this uh, defensive stat. Like it, it it seems like it's super good for aggressors because aggressors don't really need the attack anyways, so you might as well just make them as tanky as possible. And then this I think this one's like a shield set or something like that. Like you you start the stage off with like you know ten percent extra HP. Um, but yeah, that's 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 pretty much it. I think I think that's that's all. I think the biggest change is actually to the bard, like to uh to the verd. The she no longer needs crit. Plus, she's getting changed to tank type, meaning she's going to be very very good for like arena defense. Like she's going to be tanky and she's going to be light and she's gonna, she's going to steal SP. Might be pretty nice, you know. What else is there? I think that's pretty much it. Um, I think this is just going to be like a permanent new monster or maybe this is going to be for the new festival afterwards and i'm not too sure who the proc is it might be the who could it be who which which monsters exist um not too sure Maybe it's the crow hooks. Maybe it's like a light dark crow hook for next rebirth. That might be possible. All right. Anyways, I'm gonna just end the video. Um, you know, I, I really don't have too much to say. It's like it feels kind of weird having it like be so quiet. You know. Um, but yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.